before you say anything, I know you're gonna notice this gorgeous ring on my finger. Let me show you up close. No, I did not get engaged. You guys know I don't want to get married. This is the Rift Ring from Jill Maurer. I'm going to have, I don't know when you're gonna see it. I think this video is gonna go up first, but I'm gonna have a video full of Jill Maurer jewelry. Actually, I think two videos because I was able to preview a ton of it and this is probably my favorite piece out of everything she sent. So if you like it too, you want some ringy bling, a blingy ring, this thing is gorgeous. Then check out Jill's website below. I have a discount code for you because I am the discount code queen, lately anyway. Autumn 15 for a 15% off anything at jillmauer.com. And she does have this ring in other stones and I'm probably going to get it in at least one other stone as well. Oh, it's gorgeous. <laughs> Hi YouTube, Autumn Beckman here. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. My channel is all about luxury living on a budget from high-end handbags to the everyday luxuries of life. If that sounds interesting to you, please make sure you subscribe, click the bell notification icon to be notified when I post new videos, and be sure to like the videos that you enjoy. What is this? This is something that I ordered from Nordstrom. I cannot believe that they packaged it this way. I'm gonna cover my address and turn it. I mean, look at this. Can you even imagine what's in here? I know what's in here and I am so, so disappointed with this packaging. Whoa, I don't need scissors. It has a little perforated thing. Let's open it up and see what I got. Receipt and return instructions. In this unpadded bag with no protection at all other than a Ziploc bag, which is the item I ordered. It's a card holder. I think you guessed that at this point. What is happening here? Interesting, interesting. It's a card holder and it is from, can you read it there, Kurt Geiger. You may remember this is the same brand from whom I purchased this little piece, a little card holder with a keychain on the back, you can make it a bag charm. It has a little chain. And from who I purchased, this. This fancy water bottle with a leather cover and a crossbody chain strap. They have some very cool pieces. I was actually looking at a tote bag from them in this cobalt metallic blue. I think that would be a little too much for me. That was in the Nordstrom sale. But let's take a peek at this. Obviously this is metallic. It is real leather, and I think I got it for about $40. This side has three different shades of blue. I'm trying to turn it a little so you can see the colors a little better. And then on the back, it's also metallic leather in pink, orange, and yellow. I thought this would be very cool inside one of my clear bags, and you can turn it. I love the blue part. These aren't really my colors, but the blue sold me. And I could have it turned this way, and you don't even know the other colors are on the back but then a lot of people like the pink magenta color, so those people could have it faced this way, and it certainly adds quite a bit of color. Now, I will say that this is quite thin, not thin in a way that I feel like it would be damaged easily. Having other card holders in my collection, this, I think, is the thinnest. Each sleeve, each pocket is thinner than any of the other card holders that I have. The interior of each pocket is lined in a fabric and it says Kurt Geiger London there. And all the card holders I have have pockets on the front and back and then there's a slip pocket in the center, but this one does not have that. It's sewn together, which I did not know when I ordered it. So there are two pockets on the front, two pockets on the back, so you could hold four cards. And this is pretty wide, so I'm guessing you might be able to hold eight cards in here. I'm gonna slip a card in, and you can see how much room is left on the edges there. So I think this is probably wide enough to slip eight in. One, two, two four, six, eight. Yes, I counted right. For the price, it's a very cute little piece, especially being leather. And Kurt Geiger is a nice brand out of London. That stamp, I was just looking at it where it says Kurt Geiger is in silver. And on the front here, if you look at the stitching, it's done in a blue thread, but then on the back, the stitching is in a pink thread. That's a nice little detail. I have to say the stitching, if you compare it to higher end brands, more expensive card holders is not the best. It's a little crooked and wonky in several places. 
but again, I got this just to be a fun little piece. I wasn't expecting it to be the same quality as three or four hundred dollar card holders. It does look rather nice with my new ring though, doesn't it? Did come with a little, not really a booklet because it's just one page. Gives you a little care instructions to care for the leather. And then the back has the Nordstrom tag, $39. So I mean, it did arrive here undamaged, but I'm, I'm kind of shocked that Nordstrom just sent it in this unpadded envelope. They could have at least sent it in a padded envelope. I was thinking it might come in a small box, but apparently I was wrong. Do you want to say if you are into card holders or you're curious about card holders, I do have a card holder comparison video coming up. I filmed it a while ago though. It was maybe a month or two ago that I filmed it. And it has it has all of my higher end card holders, Louis Vuitton, YSL, Gucci, Chanel. It also has Coach. I'm trying to think if I have anything else that was in that video. Since that video, obviously I got this card holder and I also got a Tory Burch card holder those two will not be in that video. But if you are looking for a super fun, cute, bright, colorful, metallic, inexpensive card holder, or if you're thinking about trying out a card holder and you don't want to spend the big bucks before you buy a luxury piece, or you don't want to spend the big bucks at all on a card holder, this is a great way to try one out, only $40. So I will link it below if it's still available and you can check it out. I'm sure they have them in other color combinations too. The top, I don't know how well the colors are really coming across on the screen, but the top is like a turquoise blue and then the big piece is cobalt and the other one's somewhere in between it's a little more of a gray blue I wouldn't really call it gray but compared to the other two it is it's nice I like it and it's bendy this is one of the things I do when I compare card holders is see how bendy it is the YSL ones you can't bend and the Chanel ones are kind of hard to bend too but the rest of them are pretty bendy I think that's it for this video short and sweet again I'll link this below for you if it's still available thank you so much for watching I'm glad you tuned in and stuck around I hope you and your loved ones are doing well. Hope to see you back here next time, and I hope you are having a fantastic day. Bye.